Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, we are gonna be trying out Einstein bagels for the very first time. I know, can you believe it? I've always lived by an Einstein bagels and ours is right next to a Panera. So I'm always usually picking Panera, but I ordered a ton of stuff on their menu, like a lot of stuff, $40 worth. So hit the thumbs up, please. And we are going to be trying out all of their stuff and seeing if it's good. Cause like I do hear that Einstein bagels is better than Panera. So I'm gonna read you guys what I ordered. So I got the caramel cream cold brew, sounds delicious. And I like how big it is and it's very cold. Like it's got lots of ice in there, but it's still very big. I don't know if you guys have seen Starbucks new drinks lately. The small is literally this big, like two sips of coffee. It's crazy, crazy. So we got that. And then we got the all-nighter egg sandwich. Ooh hoo hoo. So on that is cage-free eggs with bacon, American cheese, and a chipotle sauce. And then we got the single bagel schmear with the jalapeno bagel. And then we got a single bagel with the jalapeno cheddar. They had tons of flavors, you guys. Let me read you these flavors. So there's a plain cheesy hash brown, green chili, maple French toast, six cheese, grain, asiago, blueberry, chocolate chip, cinnamon raisin, cinnamon sugar, everything, honey, whole wheat, and onion. Ooh, onion and sesame seed. So a whole bunch of bagels, tons of flavors. I don't think Panera has that many options. If so, I'm, I was never aware. And then I got their tasty turkey sandwich on the Asiago bagel. And this has turkey, spinach, cucumbers, lettuce, tomato, and onion and chive cream cheese. And then we got a plain bagel, turkey sausage, and cheddar egg sandwich. It's like a basic one. And then the cinnamon roll. Okay, they loaded me up with napkins. I like to see that. So I did an online order and I didn't notice that they closed at two o'clock. And I made here at exactly 201. And they were like, we were gonna, we were about to throw away your whole order. You have to be here at two. I'm like, I'm so sorry. Like the traffic was bad. I got here a minute late, but I know they want to like go home and close the shop up, but all right. First thing we've unboxed is the cinnamon roll. Ooh, look at all that thick icing on there. We love some thick cream, if you know what I'm saying. Ooh, we have the jalapeno cheddar bagel. My mom's homemade ones do look nicer. Mom, check this out. So this is their jalapeno cheddar. I can't wait to try it out though. And then just some cream cheese on there, which they do load that up pretty well. That is a good amount of cream cheese. And then, oh, I'm so hungry, you guys. I had a few bites of my leftover Chipotle this morning when I woke up at like nine. And I just ate like a few bites cold out of the fridge. So I'm like so, so hungry. And then I've been busy filming and doing emails all morning. So I didn't end up leaving the house to film until right now at two o'clock. Ooh, that looks really good. So sausage sandwiches are usually my favorite. I think this one is the turkey one. It feels very, very heavy, whatever it is. Oh yeah. Mmm. That looks good. They load up the turkey on there and also the cucumbers are thick slices. Okay, last thing in the bag is... Ooh. So this is their new one. This is called the uh, All Nighter. This is on a hash brown bagel. Ooh, that smells amazing. Oh, I wish I like ordered some hot sauce or got someone else in there. I don't know if they even had hot sauce, but I say first we try out the iced coffee. Cause I'm really wanting some iced coffee. I love like trying all the places iced coffees because they all taste so different. Panera's iced coffee is not my favorite, so. We're gonna be like comparing this to Panera. That is good, very, very sweet. Mmm, but that's good. You know when a coffee is like chuggable? Sometimes you get one and it's like a little bit too bitter and you kind of have to like take little sips and make a little face after it. <laughs> but this is good. If you like sweet coffee. So I say we try out this all nighter first with the hash brown bagel. I'm really curious to see what that's about. Mmm. So there's like two layers of eggs on here. Okay. The chipotle sauce on here is really good. Hmm. 
Okay. So the hash brown bagel just kind of tastes like like crusty cheese on the top. I don't really taste like hash brown, but it's a good bagel. It's not too chewy. It's thin and it's got a good crisp. Mmm. This is a good breakfast sandwich. I will tell you that. This might be one of the best breakfast sandwiches I've had. Like, it's like gourmet. It feels like it's from an actual sit-down restaurant. Mmm. How is this my first time having Einstein bagel bros? I don't know. Oh, I wanna like keep eating this, but I wanna try the other ones too before I get full. Mmm, and there's like thick pieces of cheese on it. Okay, how about we try this simple sausage, egg, and cheese one. There's no cream cheese schmear on here. This bagel is very, very soft. I definitely like the more fancy, crazy bagels rather than just a plain one. This tastes kind of like, it does kind of taste like it's from like my high school. We used to have a good breakfast at my high school and they had like these pre-made bagel sandwiches in like a little plastic bag. They were good, don't get me wrong, they were pretty good. But that is kind of what this reminds me of. Yeah, this one needs some, some more stuff to it. This one could definitely use a few dashes of hot sauce or one of those good cream cheeses. So that one, I would have to say, is my least favorite, which it's very simple. So depending on what you like. Okay, now let's try this jalapeno cheddar one. So they don't cut this one in half, but... Mm-hmm. There's no hole. Hmm. Why is there no hole? They didn't toast this one, I don't think. I really like their cream cheese and I think it's whipped that's why they call it like a schmear and you can buy like the big tubs of it too I like how fluffy it is it's very good cream cheese and this bagel has very good flavor it's got some heat to it honestly decent amount of jalapenos in there So I didn't like specify when I did ordering online that I wanted it toasted. So I guess it automatically comes not toasted, which is kind of interesting because doesn't everyone like their bagels toasted or is that like not common? But I would definitely order this toasted next time. So you get a good crunch with that. Good amount of cream cheese. When I went to New York last summer, I had my first New York style bagel. Oh my gosh, they put the thickest amount of cream cheese on there. It's so good. I love a disgusting amount of cream cheese. When I was a kid, I would eat toast like 
every single day literally every single day before school I would seriously eat like maybe five pieces of toast or more like at least five pieces and my mom would cut the crust off for me too she'd wake up with me every morning at like 5 30 6 in the morning whatever time it was it felt early sorry that was my phone silent your phone while filming you guys probably like thought you got a notification sorry it was me which that was a weird notification but she would cut the crust off for me. Now, I would eat like a whole loaf of bread. <laughs> and probably like a whole stick of butter because I didn't want just a thin layer of butter. I wanted it like thick, like a whole paste. I love when it's cold butter on hot toast or like a roll and you just bite into like the glob of butter. I don't know, I love like a cold texture with hot food. Like a bagel, cream cheese, and like putting sour cream on tacos. Mm. Cinnamon roll. Let's see how it is compared to Cinnabon, which I have not had Cinnabon in so long. Last time I had it, it really wasn't even that good. I got it at the airport though, and it was like three in the morning. But we don't have Cinnabon in our mall, so I like never get Cinnabon, but it smells so good when you walk by a store. Cinnabon. Mmm. That's good. I love that icing. Wow. But my mom probably went through like three loaves of bread with me like a week. I would eat so much toast. <laughs> so much toast and butter. I've always been a girl that loves her carbs. That's for sure. So I keep seeing on TikTok, there's like a color, a color theme that every person has. And like when you change your color shirt, like it literally changes your whole face. If anyone knows anything about that, can you let me know what you think my color theme is? I don't know really what it's called. There's like a thing where you take your skin tone and you put it into AI, like chat GT, is it GAT, I don't know. You put it into the chat box with AI and you ask them what colors go best with your skin tone. So you basically take a photo of you and use like the little eyedropper tool, get your skin color code, and then it pairs you with like your best color clothes. Isn't that wild? Mm. Mm. I feel like that's so true though because sometimes when I'm like editing my videos back, depending on what I'm wearing, I'm like, ew, I look completely different. And I think it's because sometimes it's what I'm wearing. I feel like white and tan I like on myself. And I always thought I liked black on myself, but maybe, maybe not. Okay, let's try this turkey one. They always cut the top bagel and not the bottom bagel. All that cream cheese oozing out the bottom. Yeah. Okay. Let's see here. Mmm. It's like Subway and a bagel had a baby. I know it's like not, but this one tastes healthy. This one tastes healthy and it's also very cold because of like all the cold toppings. Like it kind of feels like a salad. I 
Okay. I have tried everything. So, what do I like better, Panera or Einstein bagels? What do you guys like better? Leave a comment down below. I think I might like Panera. I don't know though, this hash brown one was really good with the Chipotle sauce on it. Mmm. Okay, this is the best one. There's, now going back to this one, this is so good. Einstein wins for this one, this is so good. And I guess at Panera, I've never had like their bagel sandwiches. I didn't know they had like breakfast sandwiches. I know they had bagels, cause I would always like get them and bring them home and get their cream cheese tub and everything. And I like how thin their bagels are. They're just very thin and like crispy and light. But I've never had their bagel sandwiches. If I'm going to Panera though, I'm gonna want like a sandwich and soup. I'm such a lover for some soup. Like dipping your sandwich in it, getting it nice and soggy. I love soup. So maybe I would say Einstein is better for breakfast. I love the chipotle sauce on this one i would even almost add a cream cheese too because the ones that had the cream cheese on it i liked that because it is a bagel it needs a little bit of some spread what do they call it spread <laughs> spread decent and then i would say i like this jalapeno cheddar bagel second if it was toasted it would maybe be my favorite. Like, look at all the jalapenos. I'm still so obsessed with my new camera. Like, the focus is so good. Like, I love using this thing. And after, like, watching it back and putting it on YouTube, it looks so glowy. Like, it looks so good. If anything, I just wish it wasn't so zoomed in. It's a very zoomed in camera. Like, this is my hand straight out, and, like, the camera is still, like, so much further like it definitely has like a zoom in feature which I don't know if I can change that because when I turn the camera on it's zoomed out but then as soon as I click record it like zooms in so I'm sure there's probably a way I can fix that I need to like do some research on this thing that's one thing about me is I'm not reading the instruction manual or doing any research I will just figure it out myself <laughs> Mm, well, well, that was good. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Let me know what other places you'd like to see me try out. There's still some other places that I've never tried that you guys would probably be surprised about. And then also some little local places that I kind of want to try. There's this coffee place that they just put up near me. They have like banana bread iced coffee, a cinnamon roll iced coffee. So I kind of want to go there and try their coffees out. They don't have any food though, which kind of stinks. But maybe if we tried like some local places for the day. And then there's also this hamburger station and like little drive-ins type vibe. Kind of like Sonic, how you just drive up and order. It's called Hamburger Station. I don't know where they're all located, but I've never had it and I really wanna try it because it looks like White Castle. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit the thumbs up and I'll see you on the next video. Love ya, bye.